Okay, to get started, I have two images open in Photoshop. A plane with a very simple evening background, and this new night sky background I'd like to change it to. Now, beginning with the new background, select the Move tool, and drag the entire image onto your main image. Then, you'll need to unlock the main images layer, so that you can drag your new background underneath it. Next, make sure your top layer is selected, then right click the selection tool, and make sure it's set to the object selection tool. Now simply drag over your subject with the tool to select it. If you have multiple subjects, you can hold down the shift key on your keyboard while dragging over them to select them. However, I only need my plane, so I'll undo selecting the runway. Okay, this did a pretty good job selecting my plane, but it's not perfect. For example, we have some sky selected under the wings. For this next step, we're going to keep using the object selection tool, but we're going to change the mode from rectangle to lasso to make more precise selections. Now, to remove parts of your selection, hold down the Alt key on your keyboard while tracing over the part you don't want. It can be a little fussy, so it might take a few attempts to get exactly what you want. Of course, you can use the regular lasso tool if you're having too much trouble. On the other hand, if you need to add to your selection, like these pointy fins down here, you'll want to hold down the shift key while tracing over the part you want. I'm also noticing I missed the tip of this top wing, as well as a few other minor areas, so I'll select those quickly. Alright, once you're happy with your selection, right click it with the selection tool, and select layer via copy. Now that we have our plane separated, we can either hide or delete the original plane image since we don't need it anymore. To move your subject around in the frame, make sure it's layer selected and then drag it to a new position by using the move tool. Okay, this looks decent, but the lighting on the plane looks weird and orangish because the sun was setting in the original shot. To fix the plane's lighting, make sure your layer with the subject is still selected, then go up to image, Adjustments, Match Color. The first thing you'll want to do is set the source to your new background image. That would be my night sky. This already looks better, but I don't like the green hue, so I'll need to play around with these three sliders to get a look I want. I'll start by decreasing the color intensity to get rid of that green color. Then I'll increase the fade, which will bring back some of its original white color, but I don't want to go too far on this or it'll make it orange again. And lastly, I'll increase the luminance to give its white a little more brightness pop to make it stand out more. Once you're satisfied, click OK to confirm the change. Okay, I really like how this looks now, so that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.